A wrestler at ASU is gaining national attention for her courage and tenacity. Team 12's Lena Washington shows us how this wrestler is breaking barriers and opening doors for other women in the sport. Marley Smith has loved sports ever since she was a little girl, but she found her passion when she was in the third grade. I tried wrestling and I just like loved beating up the boys back then. Um, and just stuck with it. When it came time for college, Marley knew where she wanted to be. ASU, um, like I loved everything about it. It felt like home to me. Being the only woman on a team in a sport dominated by men hasn't been easy. In a sport where strength and technique go hand in hand, Marley had to step up her skills and her conditioning. Marley trains with the men on the team, but with no women's wrestling teams in Division I athletics, she must compete against women wrestlers outside of college in regional tournaments. Her journey caught the eye of Walk-On's Sports Bistro, a chain of sports-themed restaurants along the Mid-Atlantic and Southern U.S. They profile walk-on athletes each week and underdogs sharing their story with a national audience. And it just caught our eye uh, and, 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 and kind of fit exactly what our uh, brand and our company is all about of that underdog spirit, that walk on mentality um, of never giving up and doing something that you love and, you know, working hard at it and uh, uh, and and pushing and pushing through to kind of reach your dreams. Being named as the walk on student of the week gives Marley the opportunity to share not only her story, but her vision of promoting D1 women's wrestling. I want to pave the path for the younger generation and give them the opportunity to be a part of a Division I wrestling school. Walk-On Sports Bistro plans to expand to Gilbert next year. Marley will become part of their family of athletes who play a role in promoting the chain and community involvement. Marley plans to stay involved, promoting the need for Division I wrestling uh, for women well after she graduates in the spring.